Hi guys, welcome to our third video on power mapping. So, so far we covered power and influence, we've talked about the roles, and what I have behind here is your power map graph. Now this is really important because it helps you put logic into who the stakeholders are, the roles, and how you're going to kind of build a successful strategy. So I'm going to get Tash to tell us a little bit about what the quadrants mean. Awesome. So basically what we're going to do is when we look at this map together as part of our marketing and sales teams, we're going to understand who are the most influential and powerful people within the organization that we're looking to partner with who would strongly support this partnership and might be ready for change. And then on the opposite side of the scale, who might strongly oppose the change in partnership? This might be a person who's got a long-term relationship with another organization or um, service that they've been using for a really long time. And then who in the organization has the least influence and power? So we know that's not really where we need to focus. These are gonna be the people that we're gonna focus on, understanding who are the key decision makers and how can we create the best kind of content for them. So that's how we're gonna start with our power mapping tool today. That's awesome. And some of the things that you need to want to keep in mind before you start, make sure you truly have one company first. Don't try to take shortcuts or approach loads of companies. Just you want to be you and your team hyper-focused on what's the account you want to get. Then try to have a list of those key influencers uh, based on all the roles that we talked about. And the third one is you need a space where you can collaborate. So if you have the chance, we highly recommend face-to-face. -face. We love being face-to-face. -face. The jamming sessions are so awesome. But if you can't, then what you can do is you can use like a digital board like Miro, which we also use for our international accounts. And we just, we just get together and focus on that one account and those influencers. And once you map it all out, it's definitely going to help you with your strategy. 100% guaranteed. Agree? Agree. Let's get into it.